I love my body because it's plastic and I want more plastic. I want to be a blow up sex doll. Catella Dash is on a quest for plastic perfection. Incredibly, massage therapist Catella was born male and has spent more than $100,000 on her transformation. Now she wants to go even further and increase her 38G breast size to a massive M cup. I don't worry about consequences and complications. I just want to have big breasts. The 38-year-old first went under the knife at the age of 23 when she transitioned from male to female. I felt very awkward before my operation, very extremely feminine, too feminine for a boy. And her fixation with being larger than life influences everything she does. I just love that overly done, exaggerated feminine Barbie doll, blow up doll sex look. I feel myself. I feel like this is how I'm supposed to be. In Midwestern Minneapolis, Catella's outrageous personality is impossible to keep under wraps. She had extremely large breasts is the first thing I noticed. Born in a male's body? That's impressive then. It's yeah. very hard to tell. Yeah. It's good work to the surgeon. But Catella's obsession with self-modification is worrying her friends who think she's going too far. I do worry about her because, I mean, she wants to... I think it's her obsession is the, it's getting dangerous. I always try to talk to her about that, like a stop doing surgeries, but she's really obsessed. I'm looking at getting like an M cup breast implants, like triple the size that I have now. However, finding someone willing to give her extreme implants hasn't been easy. Today, Catella gets a consultation with Dr. Gregory Mesner in the hope that he can realize her dream. Have you ever had any surgery before? Yes. What have you had? Breast implants, seven okay. times, eyes, nose, chin, lips, cheeks, butt, Botox, fillers. Okay. My recommendation was that she uh, probably not pursue implants as large as she's imagining. Her tissues will be stretched thinner to the point where the implant may end up eroding through her skin uh, over time. This size of an implant may create a significant additional strain on her neck and shoulder muscles. You're welcome. Confronted with the bad news, Catella weighs up her options. Well, I'm really disappointed because um, he wouldn't do my breasts the size that I would like them to do. Yet despite the severe health implications, Catella says she will stop at nothing to get the body she craves. Even if it risks my health, whether I have to go to the other part of the world or to a different planet, I'm going to get the size I want.